Gaston here from Connecting Tennis. So here we're with Paulo, okay, my player. Uh, one of the things that I, I told you in the, in the video, one of the videos of the Tennis Minute, it's how to use the medicine ball to create more power in your serve. So here what he's doing is just warming up. He just finished his, his fitness session. This is the movement he's gonna do, but throwing the ball against the floor. Now he's just warming up a little more the shoulders. Now he can start to, to throw the ball against the floor. Okay, 10 times he's gonna do this. And then after that, he's gonna go right away to get the racket and start serving. What he creates here, it's of course the difference between the weight of the ball and the weight of the racket, okay? And how he creates with all the body, you can see that his legs are a little bent. Now go to serve, uh, full power here, trying to, to take the most out of that exercise of the ball. So transferring, what we're doing here is transferring the weight, do a couple more, transferring the weight of the medicine ball to the serve. Now he's doing it, if you can see the ball right under, that's a one, one kilo, okay? So it would be like um, three, three pounds. Okay, you can do it with a six to eight pounds. Like I said in the video of the tennis minute. Like I say, it doesn't matter if the ball, all the ball goes in, okay? What we want here is just transferring the power, head speed of the racket, okay? Going through, doing that flow with the racket, that impact as hard as you can to transfer the weight. And the last one. You can see there the speed the serve gets. Like I said, I told him, don't worry if the ball is going in, just try to make it in the other side of the net. But putting all the power, not only with the shoulder, okay, but everything, going down with the legs, using the, the balance of the core, amazing serve there. And exploding up, trying to get the ball. I'm gonna show the next one a little higher. So you can see in the highest point, the explosion and how he makes the follow through and he breaks the hand to put the last pull of power to the ball. Two more. Now I'm gonna show you right after another exercise, okay, the second one that you can use. It's gonna be great. It's gonna help you a lot with the power in the serve. Let's go to see a second one. Now the second exercise, here we go a little more real in terms of the motion of the serve. You can see that he's already sideways to the court, making a little short movement with the left hand, okay, as if he was tossing the ball in the air, and then bringing all the way to the ball, really aggressive, pushing against the floor, trying to create that, that power in the ball, okay, as if he was punishing the serve. So a little couple more. This one is it's a great, it's as good as the first one. It's a little more real than the first one because you're only working with the shoulder you serve, okay, in his case, right shoulder. Now get the racket. And now again, transfer the weight, all the power he created with that medicine ball, he's gonna transfer in the serve. Nice. Again, don't worry, okay. Now all your focus has to be in hitting the ball hard and creating that power from the legs, direct the power from the legs to the core to keep the balance and then explode and try to get the ball in the highest point. And now yes, work a little more with the hand to create the last push of power forward. Ball is a little off. <laughs> After the future last week, he arrived yesterday from another um, national interleague playing for his club, lost in the final. All right guys, so you could see there, both exercises, great ones, okay, to get more power in your serve. The first one, if you've never done this before, you don't do a lot of fitness, watch out. Make sure you always warm up before doing something like this with extra weight other than the racket. If you never did it before, four, four pounds, okay, it's gonna be great, maybe two pounds start okay slow until you get the rhythm of the exercise if you already did this you work out okay you feel a little stronger you train 
or you play daily, you can go with the six or eight pounds for the first exercise, 10 repetitions, and then go serve 10, 12 balls. Remember, just focusing the power, working with all your body and going up to hit the ball in the highest point. The second exercise, okay, not as heavy as the, as the first one, maybe go with the two or three pounds of medicine ball, since you're gonna be working only with one arm. Again, 10 repetitions and then go 10, uh, 12 serves. You can do it three times, okay? Each exercise is gonna be great. Don't do it every day. You're gonna get really sore. Your shoulder needs to rest, uh, as well as all the parts of your body, especially if you're training every day. But these ones are great, okay? So here you have the advice. Gain more power in the serve is gonna help you. 10 to 15 miles to add this if you do it for at least two months, three months, but always thinking also in the right technique and everything, okay? Don't change anything in, in your serve. So thank you guys, that was it for today. Remember, connectingtennis.com, all the free lessons. We're gonna have a lot of fitness coming, okay? Um, with a new fitness coach, Pedro. If you have seen the, the videos I made with him, um, he's the, the one that is gonna be doing a, a lot of uh, exercises for us. Thank you guys, and see you in the next one.